Hi, I'm Debbie. I'm from Squiggly Twigs. I know you can't see me real well on the camera, but since I'm filming myself, I needed to focus it on the machines instead of mostly on me. I'm going to show you today how to chain sew patchwork pieces together. We use this technique to sew squares for our patchwork patterns, as well as the rectangles that go in our strip type patterns. Then we'll get right on with it. I'm going to start with the serger and ex show you that. Then I'm going to show you two other ways to chain sew with the regular machine. First, you take two of your squares, match them right sides together, put it under the sewing machine, find my pedal okay. and stitch. When you get near the end of those squares, you're going to match up two more, put it under the presser foot and stitch. Just make sure that your sets of squares do not overlap. Next set of squares. Ready? And the last set of squares ready. A serger makes quick work of this because it does the stitch and the edge finish at the same time. You'll have, the reason we call it chain sewing is when you finish, you'll have a chain of square pairs. Take your scissors and snip them apart. You notice we didn't do any back stitching or knotting of any kind. It's not needed. Now, I'll move to the sewing machine. And I'm going to set my machine for an overcast stitch. You will find an overcast stitch in your manual. I'm going to match up two pairs, right sides together. Put my presser foot near the edge of my fabric. The closer your stitch is to the edge of your fabric, the less raveling you'll have. Prepare the next set. Snip those pairs apart. Now I have two sets of four. The last way I'm, the last way I'm going to show you will use a straight stitch and a zigzag stitch. This is the slower of the options, but still effective. You'll have to make two passes through your squares, like this. First you'll do a straight stitch with your presser foot on the edge. And you'll do that for all of your pairs. You'll snip your pairs loose, and then you'll come back through all of your pairs and set to a zigzag stitch and zigzag near the edge. For all of your pairs. If you had more pairs, you just keep sticking them through in the chain manner. Those are three ways to chain sew and make quick work of piecing patchwork pieces.
Thank you.